How to easily create a countdown timer in Canva. The first thing you want to do once on Canva, you're going to select videos right below the search bar. After selecting videos, you can select the dimension or the type of video that you would like to create. For this example, I will be selecting 1920 by 1080 px. After you have selected the dimension of the video, you will be redirected to a new page. On this new page, you will be provided with a blank canvas. Once here, I want you to go over to the left hand menu option and you are going to tap on elements. After selecting elements, I want you to tap on the search bar and on the search bar, you are going to type in countdown timer so we can select it right there. After selecting countdown timer, you are going to select videos below the options right here. So you are going to select videos. Then you can scroll down and you can see different type of countdown timers that you can choose from. Keep in mind that anyone that you see with the pro or the dollar sign, you'd have to be a paid subscriber on Canva to use that particular timer. But there are quite a few options that you can use for complete the free. And also if you, for example, sake, let's say I would like to create a 15 second timer. I would recommend that you choose one, for example, that is 30 seconds or so on, and I'll be showing you how to adjust it. But let's say you would like to use this one. If I were to tap on it, you can see it right there. And if it is a case that you would like the countdown timer to take up the entire page, all you'll have to do once you have added it, you'll tap on the three dots that says more. Then you'll tap on set video as background. And you can see the timer has now been set for the entire page. For example, if I were to tap on play. But let's say you wanted to add the timer in a small box or circle in the top left hand or right hand corner. All you'll need to do, let's undo this and we'll delete the timer. All you'll need to do to do that, you'll tap on elements once more in the top left hand corner. Then from there, you're going to type in frame. So we'll select frame. Then you're going to tap on see all. After tapping on see all, you can see the different frames that you can choose from. And we're going to be selecting the circle frame for this example. After doing that, you'll tap on the elements search bar once more. And remember the timer that we had chosen earlier, you can see it is saved in recent. We're going to simply drag and place it in the circle. After you have done that, you can see the timer has now been added. And as I stated earlier, I want to create a 15 second timer. So I'm going to simply go down to the bottom of the screen right here. And I'm going to drag the cursor to 15 seconds. So let's do that real quick. So we're going to drag it to 15 seconds. So you can see right there, it is at 15 seconds. Once it is there, you're going to right click and you're going to tap on split page. After you have tapped on split page, you can delete the first page by simply tapping on the three dots on that particular page, then tap on delete page. Now, if we were to carry the cursor back to the front of our video, then tap on play, you can see that it starts counting down at 15 seconds. Now you can move the circle to wherever you want on your video. So for example, you could move it to the top right hand corner or to the top left hand corner. And then from there, you can continue creating your video. So for example, let's say I were to go over to elements and let's say for example, I'll just type in business meeting. So let's say business meeting or business just for example sake. I'm just going to add a background to it. So for example, I could select videos. Then from there, you can see the different videos. So I'll just be showing you that you can add a video with the timer right there. So all I'll do is simply drag across this video just for example sake. And I'll add it to the page. Then I'll tap on the three dots. Then I'm going to tap on set video as background. Keep in mind that this is just a, a rough example. So you can simply pull it right there. So I could pull it right there or I could add it to this section. And all I would need to do now, you would want everything to line up. So instead of it going over 15 seconds, 
we'll add it right there at 15 seconds then I'll simply delete page or better yet I'm going to tap on split page then I'm going to delete this last section so I'll delete this page right here then I'll simply carry the cursor and if I were to tap on play right now you can see right there so it has a video in the background while the countdown timer is in the top right hand corner and you can also add text and other animations to the video quite easily so if you wanted to do that you could tap on text from the left hand menu option and you can add text and so on hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative if you did be sure to hit the like button and subscribe